Uh, okay, I got to uh, cut you right there, and uh, we we're gonna go to break for a few seconds, and then uh, okay. we'll come back and continue our con conversation. Hopefully, uh, viewers will call in more. Okay. But all those three primates, you know, some rat, munity, send her, you know, will the lump of two all those three primates, I might not did, no, 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 pill, come up the clay, but so more good. ខ្ញុំបាទសូមស្វាគមន៍ព្រៃមិត្តសាយដ្ឋថ្មីម្ដងទៀតបាទជាសាជាថ្មីម្ដងទៀតខ្ញុំសូមជូននំនឹងអំ
on our show. Now we continue with our conversation about car accident. <laughs> okay. Right. So uh, let's uh, continue and where were we? Um, well, I well I had answered a caller's question yeah. and, I, and I think I've answered it. If if I have not, please call back and we can. But I don't feel any pain. I'm just saying, I'll look look straight. Pray mid mean jump ngal or some new same thing. I do the same. My colleague just bought you. How you mean pay for high cheap food? Net tiet dam bay nung chalau in some new same thing. But good late nine seven eight six five four six three five zero. From bun from pay from bay. So, the caller talk about the middleman, right? The middleman, right. right. Yeah, let me, yeah, and let me say a, a, a few words about that. You know, we are lawyers. We are supposed to be people who know the rules and help people to, to stay within them and, and get what they're entitled to uh, within the legal system. We have rules that govern us, okay? Um, you know, I'm a licensed professional, we all are, and like all licensed professionals, we have a licensing board that has rules. And our licensing board restricts our ability to use these middlemen, okay? There are a lot of things that we are not allowed to do but people do it anyway, mm -hmm. in terms of you know, in terms of paying money for cases. Absolutely not allowed. That's okay. illegal, right? Illegal, unlawful is a better term. But yes, okay, unlawful. Okay. Yes. Here's the problem, though, with those lawyers. The insurance companies know who they are. Okay, the insurance companies spend ridiculous sums of money on what are known as their special investigations units. And one of the main things that the special investigations units are looking into is what lawyers and, and what doctors are dirty, are not playing by the rules, okay? And the insurance companies love it when you wind up with one of these lawyers or one of these doctors because the insurance companies own them. They own them, okay? I mean, in other words, if they know a lawyer who's not playing by the rules, they can take his, they can take his license at any time. It's theirs you for the asking. You mean the insurance company can Absolutely. take their license? They can go to my licensing board, bring all oh. their evidence, okay, and destroy them. So anytime a lawyer is in conflict with an insurance company and the insurance company owns his license, he's got a problem, okay? The lawyer has a problem. There are things he cannot do, okay? He basically has to take what they give him, mm. okay? Just as, you know, just as... You know, if you don't go to register shop, you have to take what the insurance company gives you. These lawyers have to take what the insurance company gives them. They can't fight, okay? They can say they're going to fight, but mm -hmm. they don't fight. Uh, yeah. They can't afford to fight. They can't stand the scrutiny uh, that comes with fighting. Uh, they can't take the pressure. And so at the end of the day, it's always the client that loses. Anytime you play the insurance company's game, it's always the client who loses. You have to go to a proper body shop, you have to go to a proper doctor, you have to go to a proper lawyer, and if you fill that inside straight, if you do everything the way you're supposed to do it, there's always money at the end. Uh, there's always money at the end, and we can still get decent settlements for cases, uh, kind of a thing, if, as long as the people have done what they're supposed to do. The problem occurs, you know, you hear so much about people who, who got into accidents and didn't get money, or they got into accidents and they received almost no money. Mm -hmm. uh, the problem there is, is always the same. They, they did something wrong. They did, and it's not that they did something wrong in, you know, in some you know, moral sense, but they, but they didn't do the things that need to be done. Um, you know, commonly, like I said, they, they accepted that $300 appraisal and, and, went, and that was the end of it. You know, they went to the accident lawyer, uh, not the accident lawyer, the accident doctor, instead of going to their family doctor and then getting a referral to the accident doctor uh, kind of a thing. They, they, they just didn't run the steps properly. So is, let, let me interject. Um, what is the proper way to, sure. uh, to do? 
Well, again, we've talked about cars. Oh, let me just say one thing about registered shops. When the insurance company gives you a list of body shops, you know, a lot of people don't know, should I go to one of these, should I not go to one of these? That is actually a list of registered body shops, okay? And is a list of all the registered body shops in, this, in, in the area. And the insurance company gives that to you because they are required by law to give that to you. And that's the only reason they do it, okay? But it is the list of body shops from which you should, should pick one. Now, some of those shops are good, some of those shops are not so good for other reasons, but that is where you find the list of registered shops, and if a body shop is not on that list, I would say to stay away from it. Okay. If you get into an accident and you're injured in the accident, you know, a lot of people are, are afraid to get in the ambulance and go to the emergency room. They're worried about who's going to pay for it. Okay. Well, the car insurance pays for it. And if you have health insurance, that, that will kick in to pay for it. But a lot of people who are actually pretty badly hurt don't go to the hospital because, because they're worried about the bill. And that's, and that's the first mistake that they make right there. If you're hurt, go. Okay. Uh, from the point of view of, of a lawyer settling a case, of course, that, that's always a good thing. It, 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 it addresses a lot of issues. Um, but it's a mistake people make that they, that they don't take care of themselves properly. The first people you should call after leaving the hospital or call the day of or the day after the accident or whatever is number one, your family doctor. And number two, you know, I would say your, your lawyer. lawyer. Okay, th there's, there's no reason not to get to us right away. A lot of people believe, for example, that you need the police report before you can see the lawyer. That's not true. I mean, obviously, I, you know, I love it when people come to me and they bring me all my documentation, everything I need um, to, to, to start work, to get going on the case right away and do things. Okay, but, now we But I'm quite accustomed to people not having what I need the first time they come to see me. Okay. So I'll see them uh, a second time. We, we, time is up. <laughs> and okay. uh, let me sum, uh, do mm -hmm. the, the, uh, summarize this. So if you have an accident, if you hurt, you go to the hospital. And then you call your family doctor. Your family doctor. And then lawyer, if you want to file a claim, lawsuit, whatever. Okay, all right. Thank you very much for coming to our show, as I'm always. Uh, 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 honor to have you here. So um, we, time is over. So uh, we hope to see you again <coughs> next time. Well, I, so I look forward to coming back. Thank you so much oh, for having me, you. and I look forward to seeing everybody at, at your party right. on December 1. Hello, Sir Primit. You mean Bill the Tramney, you know, will much you about Lulu Sir Primit's side of my monotheism, the Sapada Crowd, but the Trace was a day.